Well done. Okay. Uh, now we are on to uh, Triple J, the Whisperer. What are you doing? How are you? Oh, gosh. Hi. Jeez, there's really uh, a lot of uses. Um, you have to the box. <laughs> I am way outside the box here. Uh, doo ba doo. <laughs> All right, let's see if I can uh, take over one of the guys uh, around the Fury. Oh, don't take over the pissed off one. Yeah, I'll be the guy I just took care. <laughs> <laughs> so you are going to try to take the mind of one of the soldiers with the gun. With the gun. Yep. He doesn't have a tablet or anything. You just want to take him over. Correct. He has a gun. He's got a gun. That he can point in Nick Fury's head and say, put down the tablet or I'll shoot you or I'll kill you. Sure. Yeah. You know, and I'm not kidding. Okay. I could do anything. All right. Well, roll a green. Would the bad guys not do this? Roll a green. Well, the guys wouldn't necessarily do that. No. I never roll good on this. My good. It's a 30. 30 on what's your power level? Oh, okay, so uh, our excellent, uh, that's a miss. So uh, he seems to shrug, he looks like distracted, he looks behind him, um, but then he, he seems just fine. You could still move if you like. Okay. Anything else? All right. Brian Baird, you're up. If I, can I see Nick Fury? Uh, the big guy. no, you are, you are blocked by that wall right there. Oh, man. <coughs> I guess if you scroll down, you can see the line yeah. of sight that I put up. So that wall is okay. blocking your vision. Uh, you do, however, have line of sight on uh, defense droid number 10. If, if you scroll farther up, uh, number nine, the, the one on the left is glowing. No, number ten is not glowing. I'll, I'll shoot the one that's in front of the muscle of the, the tank. Okay. Uh, <laughs> all right. And uh, have you got any skill in uh, no, no, heavy no. weapons? All right. But uh, we'll use your reason. I can press buttons. I tell her what to do. Do you have uh, agility? I do agility. All right. With the help of Andy the Android, who's like a walking user manual. Uh, you do not need to make a reason check to understand how to use it because the android is telling you how to. But okay. you do have to be pretty good with your agility to hit this thing. Okay. So you load the uh, heavy armor-piercing round into the chamber, cock it, set it, target, and fire. That's a green hit. All right. You launch the you launch it, and uh, it does 65 points of explosive damage. You have sick vibration. Wow. Sick vibration. However, that tank shell that tank shell is armor piercing. It seems to rock back and forth and then steady itself. <laughs> that was good. You uh, you have a use of power. You, you've, you've done a move. You still have the power. Okay. You can use the remainder of your turn to put a new shell in. Okay. Uh, that's it for Brian Baird. Is there anybody who's on hold right now? All right. Let's roll initiatives, please. Chris. Awesome dice. Three. I said he's got to Come on now. Bobby, got it. Never mind. Got it. He's starting to do the Got it. This one. Magic. Oh. Nice to meet you. What? Yeah, sorry. Go. Andy. 18. Ooh. Uh, Chris. Three. Uh, I rolled. Uh, what? Yeah. Three. Yeah. Now I got the super die though. Look at that person. Oh, sorry. I thought you were going to get that. Zero. Nine. 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 Nine.
Every time you have people in the video, <laughs> okay, so we've got our initiatives. It looks like the enforced droids are going first this round. Uh, and starting with uh, enforcement droid 209 that was uh, glowing white last round. Um, that's the little one on the far left. So he's in the top left hand corner if you wanted to scroll your map appropriately. Um, maybe. Let's see. Uh, if I do this. And then maybe, how about, oh, I can't do it, no. <laughs> All right. Uh, he targets the one target that he can see, which apparently is its major threat. It's got line of sight through the hole in the wall that Mikey so kindly provided, as you can see right there. And it fires at you. Well, lasers or rockets? It's firing a laser, but now the laser is shooting some sort of white beam. It's not looking like it's traditional armament. Ooh. First one hit. Ooh, second one hit too. Oh. Alright, so you are taking 40 points of damage Perf. total. They are timed to hit exactly at the same time. Uh, go ahead. Your reflection is a 26. Let's see if you're able to reflect it. I have 180 in health. Let's try the first one to see what happens. 64. 64. You reflect it back. Is that yellow? <coughs> Remarkable. 64. No. No, I need top 70. Okay, the energy bounces off, so you only take 40 minus 26. Not unless you yeah, got to yell. It's but hang, you do take damage, though. 40 minus 26 is the remainder of damage that you take. I, I can't roll for the second one? No, no, they both were timed to hit simultaneously. So it's as if they're one attack when you, for damage purposes. So you are taking 14 points of damage. And now I need you to roll... Do you have a d4? Okay. Just a second. I have to use another power for saving myself. Do I have to take how much damage? 14. D4? This means I'm probably stunned this way around. Uh, you're going to have to roll a d4 twice. You were hit twice by the white beam. You have... You're determining the attack. You have uh, four powers. Four superpowers. One, two, three, and four. Your superpowers are uh, transmission, uh, tr transportation, charging. And what are your other two? Reflection. Reflection. Detection. And detection. Okay. So that's the order. Transmission, charging, reflection, detection. One, four, two, three, four. 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 One. You just lost tr energy transmission. Now we hit you twice. So one more time. If you roll a one again, you don't lose anything. One. Okay. So all you lost was energy transmission. You can no longer... It seems like the power has just disappeared. So, so it actually targeted the correct power. The power I used destroyed it all. Yeah, I guess it did, didn't it? That was very lucky. Do I know? Oh, yeah. You know immediately. You're very much in tune with yourself, and uh, and you know. All right, that's uh, that's 209. <laughs> Uh, 210, focuses. Initializing threat assessor. Initializing threat assessor. Initializing threat assessor. Threat assessor. Targeting. Targeting. And it's still you. <laughs> they understand the idea of focused fire. I thought after that amount of time we would have been able to uh, recover. <laughs> oh, wow. First hit. Second hit. It appears that... Um, the, the laser that is firing at you is now even more powerful than the first hit. Uh, where you were taking 20 per before, now you're taking 40 per. Um, there's two hits, I'm sorry to say. That's uh, 80 uh, points of damage, but you can choose to reflect, of course. Yeah, I'm going to use... Um, how much cover do I have? Well, there's a pool. We got a pool. We do have a pool, too, but... I'm going to take 10 for the pool for each of my rolls. So 20 for the pool. So 10 for the first roll. Yeah. So we're down to 100 in the pool. Thanks for keeping track. 75. 75. Okay, so you, is that yellow? Check it out right now. Right? The reflection is remarkable. So yes. Okay. It reflects back on it to no effect whatsoever. It appears to be immune to its own lasers. And now, uh, next one. So that's 26... 80 minus 26 is what you end up taking. 
And the second one I reflect as well. Okay. Uh, oh, but they're designed to hit at the same time, so one reflection applies to both. Apologies. Okay, so I'm taking my 54 points of damage. 54 points of damage. Ooh. How are you doing there? I should regenerate. I am on below 50%. I that. How are you doing there, boy? <laughs> okay, that's it for uh, the enforcement droids. Andy is up. I'll get the leg. Okay, next up is uh, the nerd. No. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. All right, I am going to. Is there no, uh, any type of electrical device right next to the one next to me? There's an outlet. There's an electrical outlet in the wall, the remembrance of the wall. All right, can I reach him by running? Can you reach the big one next to you by running? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, he's like, he's dire you're directly. A, scroll down one, a little bit. The big one in the middle, Adam has to Oh, like, ED210. Uh, So yeah, you, yeah, if, you yep. if you run, you can reach him, but you might, one, two, three, four, five, six, yeah, six squares, you can get right in front of him. Okay, I'm going to run up there, mm -hmm. and that's, that's a word, I got it. Well, I believe. I'm going to attempt to fry his primary weapon that he uses to shoot. Are you using electricity? Yes. All right. Uh, go ahead and make a roll. Ninety-six. Ninety-six. Is that a red? Wow. Is that a red? I think that is. That better be a red. With remarkable... Yeah, that's a red. Okay, so because you are sensitive to electricity, you notice something different about the large one versus the small ones. It's shielded. Um, so it is more difficult to penetrate this one. Um, it's got about... It's almost remarkable level shielding. What's the what's your power? Level? What's the strength my of that power? power level for my electrical emission is remarkable. That is just okay. So you got four points on him there. And because you rolled a red, we're gonna go double damage. So we're talking sixty points total, of which he can shield against twenty six points. So Did you I disable the weapon? No. The shielding protected him. If you had gotten uh, the, the other one, you totally would have disabled that weapon. But it took a fair amount of damage. Oh, do you want to make that a punch? Like a standard punch attack? Yeah. Well, let's add your strength into that. Uh, ten. Okay. I'll make a note. It, what, what <laughs> I have now... Um, that beats my powers that improve in seconds for punch. Oh, well done. So now when you punch with the charge, it's an extra shift to the right. It's no longer at remarkable level. You will be at incredible level. We now have I dive into the electrical outlet to get the hell out of the dodge. Except you smash your head in the wall because you no longer have the ability to travel through electrical wires. <laughs> uh, yeah, you, you might be able to get behind that cop car. I want to get behind the pickup. Yeah, I, well... It's a, you ran six to get there. You might be able to get here on the pickup. Okay. I will take behind the pickup. Max the tank. I'm done. Literally. Max is uh, going to employ Team Ramrod. Team Ramrod is What does Team Ramrod consist of? Say Team Ramrod. Say Team Ramrod. Say Team Ramrod. Team Ramrod is when Max is going to rocking himself towards the um, robot thing that uh, nerd boy down in the doorway. Okay, got it. going to pick up said down robot and ramrod him into the big guy. <laughs> okay. I would say the robot is a little more than two tons. So it's beyond your normal capacity, but if you can get a yellow... Um, you might be able to pick it up. Okay. It might be an opportunity to use some karma. Up to you. So to do a yellow on your remarkable, normally you need a 61 or greater. Or I'm going to add 20 from the pool. Okay. It's all yours. Make sure you subtract from the karma pool. And let's see your roll. Good luck. And, uh, see, 80, 
83 80. plus, plus 20. So, yeah, you absolutely succeed. It is very difficult at first to get the momentum going. It's really hard to get that thing up, but when you do, as you start to get a little bit and it inches and inches, it gets easier and easier. The momentum helps you, and you rock it into the air with the remnants of Enforcement Droid 209. Like the one that exactly. destroyed, you want to pick up? Yes. So, you have to rocket detonate when you crash into it. So, I've got rocket drawer, I've got ED 209. Mm hmm. ED. I've got ED. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's yeah, the problem. I'm having a hard time getting up, and I've got ED now. Max, that sounds like a personal problem, buddy. <laughs> well, I did spend a lot of time in that chemical factory. Um, <laughs> all right, so. I've got EV-209 up in the air, and I'm going to, like I did with the little evil bad guy dude, I'm going to rock it down with EV-209 mm -hmm. and pound EV big ass dude. 210. 210. Okay. Right on, just drive this thing right into him. As you are diving downwards against this creature, you hear it. Aerial target is mounted. Adjusting for angle and vector. It appears to have, seems to have some sort of uh, defense mechanism that kicks in the moment you come within range, and it fires at you, attempting to disrupt you, but really trying to kill you. There are two shots. The first one hits with a yellow. It's very precise. It hit you, um, not the droid. And the second one is a green. The second one hits the droid. So it rolled yellow and it rolled green. One hits you, one hits the droid. Uh, 40 points of damage to you, so that's four. That's minus nothing. Points, yeah, minus, the 30, minus 36. So one more points. And then 40 points of damage to the droid, which is just completely absorbed. Um, you can keep on pile driving. Yes. So let's see your roll. Okay. Remarkable 26. Yep. Roll <laughs> is the combat dragon, guys? Okay. Yeah. 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 And you can't help, there's five guys. Yeah. And you know, we all want to do cool <coughs> stuff, so I, I have hurt. to get rolling cool stuff. I mean, it's going to hurt. <laughs> what do you got? 94. No way. <laughs> Remarkable uh, at 94 puts you... I oh, yeah, that's red. That is right. That's the first node of red. Yep. Dude, you and I are both red dead. <laughs> <laughs> you read it? Uh, I can roll three. I should have my magic stick. You smash it. I was wondering when you were going to use that. Uh, you smash it right in that little antenna thing. So this one's antenna is hit as well. Oh, excuse me. That's right. You did previously. I should have subtracted a few points from its uh, first aim. You only took four points of damage. It, it does get hit. Um, it sort of staggers backwards the weight of ED-209 on top of it. Um, it looked like some smoke is coming out of it. You see some cracks for the first time ever in the strange material. Um, and as you fly away, you can see those cracks are starting to like heal themselves and disappear. Oh. Yep. Oh, shit. I immediately relay that to the group. Okay. No, that's right, the internal. That was a good round. You did some serious damage to it. Uh, yeah, it's all here. Can I, you, you told me I had access to the knowledge of what the one I destroyed was? Well, you had the access to the schematics and the locations of items, yeah. Right, so can you direct me, can I, can I inform the others to any weak points in which I am aware of? You are aware, y yeah, you sure can. Um, and what you noticed, there are three things that you noticed. There's internal CPU located in the chest. Um, it is armed with rockets. When the rockets prepare to fire, there's a split second where the release opens and you have access to like the pack of six of them. If somebody were really good, they might be able to get in there. That's when you notice the electrical grid sort of opens up for a second. And then last but not least, as Max the Tank has already found, there is a targeting antenna on the left shoulder of each one, which appears to be somewhat vulnerable. So the big guy's antenna is destroyed, so it's starting to shoot off of it. Are you going to adjust his damage for I did. No, you did. <laughs> uh, yeah. Look no, at it was. It no, no. I shot him with a freaking depleted uranium tank. Here's what it looked like before, and yeah, no, need more. here's I what you're to down to. <laughs> <laughs> so it's about sixty percent. Possibly, yeah. <laughs> 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 
You're doing a good number. I'm surprised. You guys are doing an excellent job. All right, Adam, Brian Barrett, you're up. Fire. Second fire, agility check, please. Unless you got a critical... If you get a 1 to 10 critical miss, you might hit the nerve. How long am I losing my power who could say? As long as people have those manacles on, those supervillains lose their powers forever. Guess we'll have to find ooh, out. Ooh, 11. <laughs> oh. Whoa. Wow. Have you ever seen a dude drinking a tank around and whiz by your head? Uh, the <laughs> missile... Like, like Iron Man, the first one, the, the rocket just whizzes by and dodges it. The missile goes flying and hits the cop car, and it moves the cop car to about yeah, here. Thanks, buddy. Yeah. <laughs> that was the plan all along. Do you want to reload with your remainder? Yes, sir. Okay. Done. John Jacob Jones, what the heck are you doing? Whisper. Okay. Um, you can put karma into stuff, don't forget, to make your chances better. Yeah, I'm going to move forward. Alright, where to? I uh, know, I'm moving forward. Okay. Let me suggest. Prepare so that when he opens the rocket, to vibrate the six rockets that are in there. Uh, I'm going to try to, I'm gonna try to get uh, to a point where they can not see me and I can see them. Um, can't see. How far can I get up? Can you guys scroll down for uh, Chris so he can see the map? How far can I get up? Yeah. You can probably get up about six or seven squares. Okay. 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 One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We can get you maybe about here. Where's that? We did a really good job using the choke point. Okay. Yeah, you do. You line of sight to the big guy right now. Yeah, see? You can see him from here. Right inside. Fantastic. Alright, let's see. I can't hold anything, huh? You can. You moved. Uh, we'll let you hold if you want, sure. You got an You want to hold your action? Sure. Okay. You're holding. You moved, though, so you, you, all you've got left is an action now. Alright, done. Uh, oh, wait, you're the last one in the room, so you... Oh, sorry, Andy. How did I miss you? Uh, he's delayed or something. I delayed or something. Oh, yeah, you're delaying. Do you you let us know when you want? I think I'm going to have to chuck it. Okay. Oh, there's actually... Somebody's a roll back. Sorry. So you're advancing the tech forward yeah. to try to charge it. Okay, you get to about 30 miles an hour in a short time span. You get slowed down by going over a, the remnants of a jeep, um, and you attempt to crash into it. Um, roll me agility, please. You you do know that one of the one of the the D D lets. Your brother is never farting Even during green. Even during texture, soy protein. Green. Chili, okay. Which I gotta be honest with you, now it's brutal. If you did yellow, if you did yellow, you would have hit it without taking any damages yourselves. Sadly, I've got good news and I've got bad news. You hit your target. Congratulations. You do about 50 points, what you think to be of structural damage. Sadly, you guys on the inside take about 30 points of damage. Oh, Adam's dead. Yeah, no, I got <laughs> yeah, we're gonna, we're, we are going to blow it over entirely on this guy. I back up. Nothing for the third guy. You know there's a fourth guy too, by the way. Uh, you try to back up. It's not rolling. You think that a tread might have been broken, crashing into this thing. You just grind it yourself. And any actions on your part? Yeah, the one to the left. Yep. I'm going to use the sonic clap. Describe that for me, please. Uh, it's, so I, I'm between tanks, and uh, my, you can see my arms vibrating. Mm -hmm. And as they clap, it's a focused <coughs> direction as they slice through mm -hmm. here towards the uh, awesome. left nice. uh, guy. So it, it comes out as a slice of, of vibration air. And what does it do? Does it damage and knock them over? Uh, it's, it's, a, it's, a, it's a push and a slice. Nice. Okay. So it's, it's both. That's very cool. Uh, why don't why don't you uh, roll? What is that? Sound manipulation? Uh, that's vibration. It's got to be vibration. Vibration? Yeah. Sound manipulation doesn't tend to do damage. Right. It's my forty-six. Amazing vibration works out well. Okay. So uh, give me a give me a green. Thirty-seven. I don't know what that rolls. 
on a 46. So 37 is just barely a hit in the green. Well done. Congratulations. You do 46 points to it, but it seems to be shielded. So it definitely look, doesn't look like it took a huge amount of damage. However, um, it appears to kind of wobble a little bit. And uh, then all of a sudden it kind of goes over and falls on its side. And it is currently that the dot that means it's it's on its side right now. Mm -hmm. Good job. Actually, I got Do I have the mice like one of my weaknesses? Yeah, subtract a huge. That's a good point. I forgot. I get a second melee attack. I get two. My own fault. Ah, and the baton. And the baton. All right, uh, initiatives, please. What does a zero get me? That's a ten. Oh, does it? Yeah. Do you guys know we're still not quite the point where I wanted to be tonight? We because of the first yeah. Well, there was that whole hour of Texas. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, that was that was that was brutal. And Joel left after like half an hour. I'm sorry about that. It's it's too bad. Okay, you got all you got all of them in. Okay, very good. Oh, you got a tie with the enforcement droid. Roll one d ten. Let's see who does better. Six. Zero. Winner. I'm gonna put you at nineteen. No, that means you go before him. <laughs> Alright, Enforcement Droid 10. Uh, let's see. It's got a tank in front of it, but it also knows that... The tank inhibiting its movement, too. Um, it can step over the tank. It's like a, a dog, like one of those... It, it's much bigger than the tank still, so it just kind of picks up its leg and, and walks past it. It pivots and uh, looks at... Uh, Two shots with its blasters. You again. That is a hit with a yellow. Ooh, and that is a hit with a red. One yellow, one red. So you now have 40 times 2 is 80, and the red doubles his damage, so it's really 80 plus... I only was way I can avoid this, but I have a lot. 120 points of damage. How many? 120. One hit for 40, and the other one did a red. So 40 times 2, double damage. 120. What would I have to do with my reflection in order to survive? Well, if you reflect with a red, then you can reflect double damage. That would reflect 56 out of 120. You can also use karma to absorb damage. One point for one point. So you can use karma to keep yourself, or you can be knocked unconscious. But so you could use karma. You could you could use karma on your reflection roll to try to max to try to get into the red, and then you could use additional karma to reduce your damage so you're still standing. All right, I have not used my karma yet. Okay. What's left? What's, what's in the pool? I'm going to steal 20 from the pool for my reflection. Good luck. This oh, could boy. be an important roll. And I'm going to burn the rest of my anneal. Yeah, and I, it's, it's, I'm probably still not going to make it. That's fine. Well, at least we'll burn our karma doing it. <laughs> I didn't burn all of it. No, burn all, all of it. If you need to burn all of it, who cares? Burn, baby, burn. 78 plus 20 is 98. I, oh! I just reflected in the red. Unbelievable. <laughs> Unbelievable. Okay, so... Unbelievable. Let me take it. Let me see the <laughs> You have reflected double the amount of your power, which is 26, I believe. So that's uh, 52. Okay, so of the initial 120 you were going to take, 
you are now 120 minus 52. Um, so that puts you at... 68. Yep. Um, on top of that, 52 is reflected back on him, and you can target it anywhere you like. Um, Are any of the missile ports open? Or you can target it to another creature. Are any of the missile ports open? Mm, it uses its lasers. It did not use a missile. So the missile port is not currently open. Was there another control device it had sticking out of it? The antenna, but Mike the tank got rid of it. You might be able to target the antenna of the other creature. Uh, if you I would target the leg, do I have to say the same or the leg is well, you recall that it is shielded against its own laser damage, so it will be very difficult. Maybe an agility check, I don't know, 56 points of damage, it's probably going to absorb a good chunk of it. it, would, it on a red... Wait, is the down one have anything exposed? Is it still cracked? Uh, the, the down one uh, doesn't have any open casing or shells, um, but it does have the antenna. Still. Is it still cracked anywhere? Did it fully heal from where it was cracked? Did you reflect it back into the crack? You don't see any cracks anymore. I'll just target the one with, I'll target the antenna on this one. Okay. Uh, agility barrel. check, please. You target the barrel through the barrel. And. 62 on re. What's your agility? Oh, my agility. Uh, 26. Do I get the bonus for my marksman on that? Uh, it's not really yeah. a an item, <laughs> but it still puts you at uh, sixty-two. Still puts me green. The last green, two squares. Yeah. So uh, you do hit the antenna, and you do sufficient damage that you see it blacken and blister, and it appears that the one that is down has just had its antenna destroyed. Not but back now back to your damage. I'm 68, I believe, is the number I have left. 68 is what you have left. I'll burn off 48 of my farmers. How many do you have left right now? I have 50. Wow. Okay. I don't burn all of my karma, all 48. Have you been able to go yet? Your turn. That was your turn. It's not my turn. It's my your, your defensive turn. I'll burn 48 points of karma, reducing my damage to 20. And my hit points to a mere 30. Very good. Wow. I only have 25. I'm at Okay, and Fort Android 10 is done. And uh, Nerd, you're up. Oh, it's your turn now. Come on, Why don't we use this bird? You can hold if you want. What I'm thinking is, and this is just real quick, if I can transfer bot, if I can transfer mines from Adam into you, he can then use his visual to go ahead and turn one of its joints into air or disable it somehow using his matter manipulation. Why can't he do that anyway? Well, it hasn't yet. Well, you've well, got to shoot him from a tank. Use your matter manipulation. You've got a power man. Yeah, I have power with a tank. Yeah, he's squishy though. He yeah, gets out of that tank. He's. Uh, yeah, but if you could see him, then turn, <laughs> turn his turn his leg into water. Turn eight pounds of his leg into water, and then he falls over. Come, 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 come. <laughs> then change it into mercury. Mercury. Nerd, what are you doing? That's my turn. It is your turn. What are you doing? No, that's only thing. He's shielded. I, I'm not allowed to use against him. I still can't transport out. Nope, your power has not returned. Uh, I'm going to run out there, whack it twice my stick and run back in. I'm, nope. I got, I, got, I got decent cover there. Okay. So I'm going to use my big, my big <coughs> stick. Get the hell out of there. You, mean, you get 50 points, it's going to smear you all over the No, are you guys going to finish it off? It's got 30 points. It's even lower than 50. I was what? I, dude, if you've ever seen me play, I play the hero. <laughs> oh, fantastic. <laughs> the dead one. <laughs> he dies <laughs> What is that? What is the dead hero called? Dead. dead. <laughs> <laughs> so the first one, energy mission is remarkable. What did you call the dead hero to eulogize? <laughs> Martyr? Oh, my 39 hits in the green. Good job. All right. So you're doing a total of uh, are you charging it? Oh, yeah. All right. So mark off the power, but that's uh, your 26 plus 5 for the extra charge is 31. Plus my strength. Plus your strength, which is... 41. Your strength is... Oh, that's 10. So 41 damage? Yeah. 
Nice. Actually, my emission is 30. Oh, excuse me. So it's an extra 4 on top of that. So 45. Yes. And roll again. See if you hit the second one. Fighting plus energy plus weapon. That's him. 65. I'm one short of the yellow. All right. So same damage as the first time around. Bob, are you including fighting plus energy skill plus weapon? It's a strength plus energy still plus weapon damage. Yep. And then I retreat back to where I was behind the cart. It looks beat up now. There are cracks, possible holes in it. You've done a number with that thing. Whatever that thing is, it's it's putting a hole in it. Is it regenerating? Maybe, but slowly. It's not as fast now. Definitely not as fast now. All right. It's now enforcement droid number 209. Enforcement Droid 209 stands back up, writes itself, and it turns, and it seems to be attempting to target, but the antenna, the blackened antenna, is like swiveling, but not quite making any movements. Uh, it is aiming for the nerd once again. Yep. Ooh, that normally would hit, but because the targeting systems were destroyed and you have cover, it's a miss. And the second shot hit in the yellow, even with the minuses. Uh, minus twenty. Oh yeah. Forty-three. Is that remarkable? Uh, my reflection is remarkable 26. Then that's in the green. You have successfully reflected it. So I still think something else on. Uh, no. You're, it's at 26. 26 minus 20. You're still in it. Guys, I'm not 11 uses of my powers, by the way. I'm not halfway tapped out. Droid is done. Max the tank, you're up, buddy. Max, Max take out the big boy. You know what I'm saying? I can't think of it. Max. Yes. Oh, I forgot. This should be like right there. So, Max, as he's flying around, um, circling, is going to the drain. communicate to the. Basically, talk to see. So he's talking. He tells yep. the nerd he that he's going to come by and grab, stick the rod up in the air. I'm going to grab it. You're gonna take the rod, the, ner the rod from the nerd. Yep. Okay. Uh, nerd, did you catch that? <laughs> he he wants the rod. He wants your rod. I was actually gonna toss it my rod. I was actually gonna actually toss my rod out there for them to use. So. You can't toss it, but you might just be able to do this. Just don't put my hand off. I won't. And by the way, you can't hurt me. Someone you borrow my new toy. <laughs> oh. 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 I will smite the cat. You, know, you can't hurt me. For hitting you because you're going to use it as a toy because it's so effective. Hmm. I don't know just how effective it is. Uh, make an agility roll to see if you can scoop it. If you That's a green. Just how effective it is. Is that all new damage or is that old damage? Uh, that's, she's been scratching it too long. We've already replaced one. Poor guy. She's too quick. What's your agility? Uh, my agility is 36. I rolled a 78. 78. That is a hit, and that's in the yellow. So you cool. zoom at rocket speed over him, snatch it up as uh, as you pass by. You now have the rod. Um, so as a whole, as a whole roll, or the whole move, mm -hmm. the intent is stay in his position. My intent was to come in from behind him. Okay, so you're zoomed out to like here. So Bob, so we're gonna come in. From, from back here on the top of the, the north front of the screen, yep. grab the rod, holding the rod as I grab it, putting it out in front of me and driving it right into the chest okay. of the ED-10. So I need a uh, roll on your uh, rocket power. Uh, rocket power, got it. Head in for the chest, that's where the CPU is located, but it's well shielded, so you need a, a yellow to hit the CPU. A green will hit the, the chassis, will hit the structure. So remarkable 26. Seventy-one under remarkable. Yes, I get a yellow. Aerial target encountered. I 
As you approach, once it fires at you again. Two shots. Yellow. Ooh, wow. And red. Oh, if you can dodge a wrench, you can dodge a ball. <laughs> you are in the exact same situation as Josh, uh, as the nerd. Uh, you've just been hit by double lasers, one for 40 and one for twice damage, so 120 points. Uh, but you have body resistance. They count as one attack. Your body resistance is 36? So it's 120 minus 36. You have 84 points of damage coming your way. Me. Well, you've got karma, and you can soak damage with karma. <laughs> One Once you're out, you're karma. Burn all your karma. Um, I have 47 karma. Yep. Nice. Yeah, what, how many hit points do you have? I have 70, 70, 68. 68. So if you expend 15 hit points, uh, 15 karma, okay. you got one hit point left. If you want to expend more than 15, for every extra above 15, you restore more of your health. I'll expend... I'll expend 35. So 20 hit points leaves you with 20 health. Wow, that was a very lucky roll on its part. And that was with the minus, because you destroyed its tracking system. All right, so... Now, no. let's well, see your... Yeah, that's true. Let's see your roll. Sure. What do you got on this guy? So, uh, is this green line getting maybe, maybe... No, no, that's the the one that you destroyed. Uh, here, I'll... Oh, okay. All right. I'll wait, 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 wait. There, now it's got no green line. Okay, so... It's the one you threw on top so of him. 71 was in the yellow to drive the... Right through. Oh, that's right. Yeah. Um, so that's a yellow. that's a yellow. That is a strike. So now the damage that we do here is we take 36 just from the rod itself. Okay. On top of that, we take 26 from the power of your rocket. Yep. Um, for these purposes, the rod is considered to be armor piercing. Okay. Um, and so it's going to ignore the armor on this guy. Okay. And so we're looking at 36 plus 26... What's that? 50, 62? 62. Oh, all right. So it pierces <laughs> minus 62. It is on its last legs. You did not quite pierce the CPU, but it is cracked. It looks like even now the regeneration units are not quite working as expected. You're seeing flashes of sparks. There's not much left to this thing. Well done. That's a good move. You might be able to swoop past. One note, though, I don't think you're going to be able to take that rod with you. It is embedded deep in the chest of that thing. Yeah, no, no, I was, I, I was actually... Where is the other toy? The other one is right here. Is there any possible way that... Because I get this thing with whatever... I mean, would it have stopped me? Uh, it literally be like... Because you rolled a yellow, I'm giving you the opportunity to fly... Oh, farther away from it okay, to right. hit and strike because okay, you rolled right, the yellow. That's what, that's what I'm asking. I'm just, yeah. Because I'm, I'm thinking I, I threw the thing 20, 25 miles an hour. Like, <laughs> you know, I, I, I really, yeah, if he hit a green, he would hit it and then he would he would go crazy flying off in a direction. Okay, so um, <laughs> my intent after that is to pull straight up. Okay. If possible. Uh, Straight up into the air. I'll just put you like right here for now. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> but we'll assume that you are about 160 feet in the air. Well, a little less because you used a good chunk of your, let's say like 90 feet up, maybe yeah, half that so distance. Fun. That was a good move. Wow, nice job. All right, so now we have uh, Triple J, Chris the Whisperer. We have the big guy on his last legs. Uh, we have a uh, knocked over, marginally damaged ED209. What do you want to do? Uh, after you is uh, Andy the Android and Brian Baird. Alright, so my option now, I am in the... It's, it's Triple J's turn, oh. but if you guys want to coordinate real quick. Hmm. <coughs> I'll You're going to hold? Okay, now it's all you, Andy. Here, I'll I'm going to jump out, because the yeah. vehicle is... So, are we by any chance aimed at it? You're pointed at it, yes, you are. 
Yeah. I'll say add fire. Out of the way. Wait, this close? Your shield is in the tank. <laughs> oh, you have vibration. Can you get out and just help release the fire? Uh, I have to be able to see it. I'm probably better off being in the tank. <laughs> <laughs> you already took 30 points of damage in the tank. <coughs> Sounds delaying it, Bob. Okay, you're delaying. All right, so that means Brian. 33 on my remarkable agility. And what are you doing? You're firing? firing. At the blank range. You realize that... He said fire without okay. delay. All right, very good. We'll see how badly Andy the Android fucks me over. Remarkable on 30... <sighs> Is a miss. It's just a miss. Uh, it misses. Um, the tank is actually pushed backwards slightly, and <laughs> you take you take ten points of damage from the concussion. Yep, that's Brian. Brian Baird takes ten, and you stay. You were in there too. Yeah, I was, I was trying to get out, but I thought that we were aiming oh, to play. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, you know, I don't load. Okay. Uh, but can I see the, the one that's in front of me? Yeah, oh, sure, you can. I will use vibration energy mission to just try and rip open some of that armor, you know, some of those cracks. Those cracks are already open. You can get inside good if you can want. I see the CPU. It's kind of good. I don't know. <laughs> Sure! <laughs> Wait, how do you think it's just Intel on it? You can change 8 pounds into anything! It's what actually, it? it's not Intel inside, it's just the nerd inside. <laughs> we have, uh, somebody took the, the Intel, like the Core 5 uh, sticker from their laptop and put it on our coffee maker. Or you can choose to enhance him right now if you want to drop your hold and improve his... Vibration? Yeah. yeah. You can increase it by 14. I won't, I won't look. Okay. 54, which should be good for my remarkable. Monstrous vibration. Oh yeah, monstrous. And oh, you're just shy, aren't you? Or no, it's a yellow. You hit a yellow, didn't you? I think that is a yellow. Yep. And uh, the creature is completely unprotected. It has 63 points of health left. What is your mod? That's very impressive. Uh, it smokes. It bursts. There is a small explosion, and then. The ED 2010 is no more. Well done. Except I, I use the power guys. <laughs> awesome. uh, and that Wait, leaves uh, John Jacob Jones yeah. and yeah, Android. Which one of you wants to go first? Uh, okay. You have line of sight. I do. From where you are, yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and give me claps. Oh, okay. Oh, you're all the way on the left, right? Yep, all the way on the left. Chris, can you clap that car in front of it into it? I can. On a yellow. It's going to be a harder one. Let me see if I can slice it, because my dice suck. You can add karma to it. You can throw yeah, some karma at that. Karma for because there's dead. Okay. So I'm going to use my, uh, my clap attack, the little sonic clap. Yep. I'm going to see if I can uh, do some more damage. All right. Sure. I actually played 65. 65 on your, what power is it? Remarkable? No, it's, it's amazing. It's amazing. That is a hit, and that is a yellow. Yep. Same thing as before. You do damage to it. You're not sure how much, and you have knocked it over. Knocked it over? Yep. It's on the ground. And uh, do you want to move? I do. Where would you like to move to? Out of its line of sight. <laughs> <laughs> I think that's pretty good. Yeah, it's not going to like me after that. Virtual system at 75%. Rerouting power to the main reflector dish. Do you want to go here? Uh, well, you can't see to yourself on the map. Yeah, to the left. <laughs> All right, uh, Andy, you're up. I'm going to hop out Full of the spread, tank. Okay, you're out. Run over to the white car. Okay. Within about four uh, squares of it, oh. and then I'm gonna unleash my energy ambition. Ooh! All right. What type of energy? Oh, the, your basic one, right? Yeah. All right. I think that was laser, but I'm not sure. I think it was like some kind of uh, middle of the road uh, spectrum. <laughs> okay. And what do you intend to do? Fry the car? 
No, fry the uh, guy that's on the ground. Oh, you're using the um, car as cover, yeah. and then you're frying the guy on the ground. Okay, very good. Green will hit. Alright, jump out of the the 36 and better. 64. 64, unremarkable. That just, is a... Just shot. Son of a gun! Alright, what's the power level on your uh, energy mission? What is the value? Yeah. 26. 26, excellent. Okay, so you take, you take some level of damage, you're not sure how much. Um, well, it's not giving you all of its information. <laughs> uh, it seems hurt. Uh, anything else you want to do? All right, one roll of uh, an it, guys. Tower Let's see one more roll of an it. Behind the car. Tower behind the car. Okay. Uh, Josh and I will start with you. Hey. Biddy. Mike Tank. Eleven. Crystal Whisperer. Six. Oh, you're Jeff the Android. Sixteen. And Adam Bryan Bay's bat has a seven. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna hold. For what? I'm the last for guy. <laughs> <laughs> that was my whole game plan two weeks. I'm gonna hold and do it. Nope. <laughs> God damn it. This car's going to be a it targets the nerd once again. Oh, <laughs> oh, hang on, wait a minute. I take that back. It it no longer assesses you as the primary threat. You the thing that just took down ED two ten is the primary threat. Yeah, that's you. Yeah, but the person who who really knocked it open and opened up the armor was was Max. Yeah, you did some damage. I did roll. I just because I'm in the air hand, I'm going to try to move. You can try to dodge. I'm going to try to dodge. Okay. I'm he got a yellow on his first hit and a green on the second hit. Yeah, I'm definitely trying to dodge. With his, his tracking down, he's minus one shifted. Now, if you want to dodge, make an agility roll. Okay. If you get a green, it's a shift of negative one for him. Yellow is negative two, and we'll go red is negative three. If you get a, a, a green, only one of his shots will hit. And the other one will be in the green. Very nice. Is that yellow? I'm sure. So it's remarkable. 81 is definitely yellow. Okay. So the first hit. Uh, is shifted back enough because you are dodging that it goes wide. You take evasive maneuvers in the air. You, well, you can't do this because you're not yeah, really But you shoot. You add some extra velocity. The second hit, though, is reduced from a yellow down to a green. So that is still going to hit you. Uh, 40 points of damage. Oh, four points, right. Body armor. Oh, yeah. Oh, oh, and roll 1d4. <laughs> uh, and we're gonna say we're gonna say this: rocket power, body armor, regeneration, and that's it. Because regeneration counts as two, right? Are you kidding? Nope. <laughs> that's horrible. Just the the perfect choice of what it would choose. All right, so now you are falling uh, at at 90 feet in the air, 32 feet per second. You have about two rounds before you're going to hit the ground. Uh, you suddenly stop moving and you start going down downwards towards the ground. But you have two rounds before you hit. Do we hear a very loud swear? I don't know if Max the type Tank is the type of guy that swears or not. No, he's quiet. All right, who's up? All right, uh, now it's Jeff P90X, uh, Andy the Android. Do the Firing again. Yeah. Okay. I really wish you'd stay closer to where we started so I could just grab that tablet plate. So the fact that these things can, like, negate our powers is bad. 63? Uh, you do the exact same amount of damage as last time. Yeah. That's right. So the military can negate our powers. Yes. And I switch back so I lose the line of sight of the, the wall.
Maybe that's the sidewalk right there. Where are you going, south? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. You're going around the building, maybe in that break in the building, Ooh. like something like that. Just out of the yeah, nice. Okay. Not too far that I will have. Like that? Yeah. yeah so it's out of its line of sight. Yeah. Okay. It looks damaged. It definitely looks plenty damaged. You can tell in the health bar, maybe 50%. It's not doing as much talking you right can now. Tell the health bar above it. <laughs> I see the health bar up here. Oh, you're oh, All right, nerd. You're running out of trouble. You guys are in trouble. All right. Uh, you see the um, you see Max the tank tumbling in the air above you, about 90 feet up. Yeah, nothing I can do for him. Mm. Uh, I will catch him. <laughs> it's like a bug funny cartoon of Amy catches it. They both end up on the ground. <laughs> <laughs> I'll have you know. All right, I. Uh, can I advance on my rod of the big guy and still shoot a ball? Ooh. Yeah, that's. You never want to hear no. that again. What is this one? <laughs> <laughs> the rod is really in there. I mean, he went with such force. All right, so pulling out after that. You'd have to, you'd have to do a strength check, and it would have to be yellow or red. That's fine. I, can I, can I shoot? Can I pull the rod out? Okay, whip it out. Can I shoot with? Can I, do I range shoot my charge ball? Absolutely, you're a marksman. So I will shoot that guy. Can you use your power to charge the ball? No. Okay. He lost his power to transport through. Electricity. That's oh, that's right. He ran into the wall. <laughs> that's right. 94. Are you kidding? No. All right. You get double damage. I Do you want to know if it's red or not? I need to know if it's red, yeah. I've never rolled that high. Ever. It's incredible now because it shifted up Ever. one. That's just in the red range. Okay. Correct. So I go from... Remarkable to Incredible. Incredible. Bless you. 94 puts me out. Justin Squirt, bless you. I'm in the red range. So, double damage for you, my friend. Uh, let's add it up. You have uh, 30 from my energy. Damage. And then on top of that, the, the, the ball you said were steel balls, right? Yeah. Okay, so we're going to say steel has a strength of approximately 26-ish. So we'll do 26 plus 30. So 56 points of total damage. Um, and you hit with just expert, I mean, you absolutely nail it. You know the cover on the missiles? You have destroyed the cover. Missiles are, missiles are open now. Okay. Uh, do you want to move? Or are you staying where you are? Uh, I'm going to... Keep my cup there. Okay. It'd be relatively okay there. Max the tank? <laughs> You're falling through uh, the air. Max the tank's falling. I, I really don't think I can. I mean, can you I attempt to. I mean, like, what am I wearing? I mean, um, can I cape as a pretty Yeah, yeah. I mean, like, can I. Is there any way I. Can, is there any way I think I can slow my descent? Um, I mean, I know I'm coming down. Right? I mean, that's pretty obvious. <laughs> so the question is, you, not, I, I, I'm fully aware that I've lost my rocket. Yeah, oh, you are absolutely yeah, aware of that. That's the thing, I mean, I'm, you know, so, is there, basically what I'm looking for is, is there anything other than pavement that I can potentially get myself to land on? Um, you can try to angle your body. That's what I mean, like, if you, that, you can try to use an agility like check, well. almost like tumbling. Okay. To try to minim like minimize the angle with which you hit, and maybe even try to roll, okay, perhaps. Roll slide, <laughs> yes. Like, what if yeah. you angle yourself onto the end to the ED? Uh, I was thinking like slide into him and like take him out. Oh, I can I can direct the fall. Okay, so perfect. I, so I, why I, don't you yeah. use me as a battering ram? <coughs> yeah. Through the air. Yeah, that's the plan. Okay. I'll do that on my next one. And, and point me right in this chest that's now cracked open. And you guys are communicating because he's still yep. making your communication effective. Yes. Yep. If you did not have him, none, you would not be able to. You would not be able to do this. All right. So, uh, so be prepared. Uh, I guess you're going to hold your action. I am going to hold my action. I am basically going to turn myself into a human missile. Yeah, we're actually going to use uh, the the bat's agility for this because he's using you as a projectile. How many areas is he? I have a little bit of eight areas. He's 90 feet up, but it's his turn, so uh, he's just fallen 32 feet per second, so he is just dropped into your range. He's he's less than 80 feet up now. You're, if you take a look at the turn up thing there, you should be, yeah, you're right after them. That's exactly right. 
any chance I could get in on it and vibrate his amp? Oh, okay. Communicate with these guys. If you're going down, I'm going to vibrate your hands like a weapon to make it almost like a vibratory weapon so when you go in, it's going to get cut like a hot knife in butter. When he's strong enough, he's got body resistance. That wouldn't work with anybody else's hands, but it would work with his. Hey, Mike. Yeah. How's 82 sound? I like 82. Let's, let's see your roll in vibration to make his hands move. I didn't get it. You didn't roll. You didn't roll. It's so cool. Come on. Come on. 80. Is that yellow or red? What do we got? So, what do I got? 46. I need to well, know I if it's... Solid six. yellow on oh, my... Shit. That's gotta be 46. All right. amazing. So, 80 yellow is definitely got, the yellow. yellow. Excellent. Okay, so you will be doing, instead of half damage on a green, full damage on a yellow, double damage on a red. So now, your hands are taking on the power of his vibration, which is how many points? 46. 46. And then you, that's exactly, it. and it would only work with him because he can take the punishment. Anybody else's hands would turn into putty. Your agility just worked on a yellow. Did I hear that correctly? Yes. All right. You, you turn Max the Tank into a weapon of Max destruction. He goes flying into the creature. And the total damage here would be the strength of your body, which is 36, plus the speed with which you are being directed or falling, which is, what's your levitation? My telekinesis is... Or telekinesis? Yeah, because I'm pushing you as fast as I can. Oh, no, I'm accelerating with my telekinesis as well. And what's the strength of your vibration? Huh. I have a number. I have vibration control 36. 36? Should I have my vibration control for Yes, because right now, all those numbers combined, uh, there, are, there, are 10, there are 10 points left on this creature. So 46, my wife's mind, 36, mm -hmm. 36, and I have vibration control. How much is that worth? It has 10 hit points left. If you add your vibration control, it will be enough. I control sure. his hand. Does he have to roll for that? What's that? Does he have to roll for that? For the damage? Oh, oh yeah, he does. Sorry, we don't we don't have him dead yet. Roll your vibration control. Seventy five. Hello? What's the power on your what it's fourteen? So a typical seventy five. That's a green. It is a it, it's a solid. Use two powers, because you use two powers for that round. How does it work using multiple powers in somebody else's turn? I just should have added my uh, well, vib vibration control kind of goes hand in hand for him with his vibration. But okay, uh, you pummel through him. You just crash right into him. Um, I have good news and I have bad news. You have taken this this thing and dissected it. It falls into two different pieces. It doesn't even have a chance to speak. Um, However, you did about 86 points of damage to the creature, uh, and he took approximately 86 points, minus your 36, for a total of 50. You are knocked unconscious. Yeah, yeah, no. How much karma? No, it doesn't matter. You don't have enough karma to cover you? Oh, cool. Uh, well, hold on, hold on. If we think we're done, pull from the pool. If I pull from the pool, I'm going to the pool. Before you can do anything further, Nick Fury emerges between the rubble with the slow clap. I manipulate sound so I can't hear it. I told them that you wouldn't have what it take to take them down, but I see that I was sorely mistaken. That was a very clever use of your powers, and it is clear that you've given my research and development team something to think about. Well done, group. I was going to say, thanks. Can you help that guy out with that conscious? I don't want round two. We, we didn't even come close to trying. I, I, I believe these points. It won't be a rematch. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. Next time, we got a whole new thing. All right, same time tomorrow. Medical staff up here. They, uh, they quickly take uh, care of Max. Uh, fortunately for him, he is healing at a rate of one point per, uh, per second. So in approximately 10 minutes later, 
he's able to get up and start dusting himself off. Yeah. Uh, it is interesting, though, this is kind of, aside from the time that that guy got that one shot on his pinky, this is the very first time that you've ever seen Max bleed. He is bloody. He is bruised. He looks like he went 12 rounds with Mike Tyson, and he looks like Mike Tyson won. I went, I went 12 rounds with Mike Tyson with like arms and legs tied. Yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, you <laughs> cut <laughs> and he's not the only one who is horribly damaged. When you take a look over at, at the nerd, when you look at uh, Brian Baird. I bumped my head on the control mechanism of the I just tried to pull it out. You go down and you, and you pull it out. Nick Fury says, you, both of you aren't bad with that thing. I tell you what, if you manage to promise a, to sign a non-disclosure agreement, and a, a treaty against sharing this technology with any foreign uh, countries or uh, planets, uh, I'll let you take that home with you. That means that if you lose it, we have to go get it back. No matter what. You can live with that. Can't you Thank you very much. Create that now? Uh, it's a, it's, 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 you have to roll out red to do it. I would probably have to roll out red to do it. So yeah. let's take a week to do that. And then keep trying and trying and trying. And you make some armor, like the Juggernaut's helmet. Guys, good job. I think. I don't know if I'm gonna. There was one more thing I had planned, but I think I'm gonna jump. I think I'm gonna jump, and we'll finish off on this right here. Oh yeah. By the way, I think I have the most hit points out of all of us. All right. Maybe I'll wait. Maybe I'll wait. But I want to say that. I'll hold off. That was a very satisfactory victory. That was fun. Was it, guys? You had a good yeah, time. It was a very satisfying victory fight. I had I had a couple things planned for you tonight, and the the one thing that I've been waiting for three sessions to do, we still can't do. I still have my Bailey's. <laughs> I, 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 used to, I used to like to I talked to him this morning, and my plan was to turn us both into electricity. Oh. Travel inside the thing, and then let him rock it out. Rock it out. Oh, so wow. Like, from the outside in, but not the Guys, inside. that would have been smart. That would have been very smart. I said I should work myself. It worked out pretty well. You would not have worked on the uh, Defense you, Droid you 210. I thought of, I thought of uh, uh, you are on the on transferring minds of him to him and electricity him while he's grabbing him. I, I want to say you guys had some very good ideas. Number one, uh, Jacob Jones's idea of taking John. over. Sorry, John Jones's idea. Triple J. Triple J's idea J. of taking over uh, Nick Fury. If he had rolled high enough and succeeded, then. Uh, he would have been able to manage that tablet, which was indeed controlling some of the robots. He might have been able to take a couple out that way, and that definitely would have been fair game. So, good idea. But they were immune to each other's... Well, they weren't playing rockets and guns and stuff. There was no way of rolling laser games ever. He could have... He could have he could have turned it down, just deactivated it yeah. on the tablet, something like that. Like a 30 oh, karma, the next 40 thing, karma, fine. I yeah. told you, if, if, I had, if the tank hadn't pulled up so I couldn't see him anymore... I would just turn around and rip it out of his hand with my telekinesis. Big guy, this is a choke point. Let's completely ignore it. <laughs> <laughs> and I, that's the worst part. I thought that was really clever. I, I love what you guys did with the rod. That was that was excellent work. Josh, getting inside of it was impressive. Just so you know, though, they are adaptive. If you, yeah, had, I, I feel like if you had tried to get into either of the others, two, it would not have worked. Oh, okay. Yeah. And, and ED-210. ED-210 was already shielded, but the second one, after witnessing that, would have shielded they communicate with each other wirelessly, so they know which one's wounded, and they will target that one as evidenced on the nerd. Um, yeah, they, they wrecked my ass. If, if you hadn't got, taken the fight to them uh, so quickly, if you had stayed at your choke point, they would have identified you as being light-dependent, 80% light-dependent, because one of you can see in the dark. They would have systematically destroyed all of the lights on the map, leaving you in darkness except with the lights that you could generate or carry. Um, you would all have negatives to hit except for the bat. Oh, wow. So it's good that you, you did what you did because it would have been very difficult to target antennas and stuff like that. So that was a pretty good move on your part as well. Nice work, guys. You did an fly? excellent job. Bob, nice work from you. They can jump, yeah. but they can't fly. Yeah. Uh, I, you I'm assuming that those didn't come from a module. Mm -hmm. No, I just, I just <laughs> made it. That is impressive. Yeah. That is freaking awesome. You guys did an excellent job. I wasn't sure if you were going to take them out. There was some really good creativity no, it, there. It ended up being a lot closer than it looked like it was going to be. So do we lose that pool of karma that we put in? Or so that 80, or is that, do we get keep that? Whatever you did not use is still yours for next okay, session. So still a pool of 80. Yeah, it's just whatever you used is kind of gone. And then I will... It's gone forever. However, you earned a crap load, crap load of karma 
for this session. I'll, I'll email you. I just want to check my numbers before I send it off. Okay. But those are good fights. Um, you get extra points if everybody was still conscious at the end of the fight, which you came very, very close to getting, but not quite. More, more than eight, because we can just retcon him into being conscious of yeah. that karma. But there are, points, there are points gained for identifying weaknesses, for leveraging weaknesses. So well, I was going to say, if, if, yeah, if we knew that that was the case, we could shoot the karma to make sure that yeah. he's unconscious. But we're so using the, what we have at the battlefield. Um, I'll yeah, you so we can that yep. I have to. Uh, I have to tally all that up, but I think you guys did very well. I have a feeling that you definitely made more on this than uh, you lost. And look at it this way: all the damage you're doing this time. Uh, there's no city that's uh, angry at you for a change. Yeah. There are no yeah. elected officials that are really uh, pissed off. So. Nice job, fellas. Good work tonight. Nice job, yeah. And I'll email you to uh, Chris so we'll have a conversation about fun. Yes. I'll wait for you to send the email and then we can go back and forth. I okay. think we should. Okay. I will.